Jean? Are you not getting enough greens at the cafe? Oh, no. I'm actually picking medicinal herbs. See? Wow. You've got a ton picked already. This one acts as a painkiller, and this one is useful in several ointments. It used to grow all over my home island, but it's gotten harder to find lately, so I'm picking some here to send back to my father. For the clinic on your island, right? This is a lot for one person to harvest alone. Let me help you. No, no, no. That's okay. You must have a lot of other important things to do, Divine One. Not so many that I can't lend a hand here. Besides, with the war and your studies, I bet you're so busy you barely have time to sleep. <laughs> I should have known the Divine One would see right through me. That's right. Nothing gets by me. If you really wouldn't mind, then yes, it would be a big help. Thank you. Picking herbs again today, I see. This one really makes a difference in treating all kinds of illnesses and injuries back home. I used to go out all the time with my father to harvest these. I didn't get to talk much with your father on the island. What's he like? Whenever I succeed, in studies or in helping out, he praises me like a well-behaved puppy. But when I mess up, he gets very upset, like he's scolding a misbehaving puppy. So, you're a puppy either way, huh? <laughs> now that you mention it, he was the kind of dad where some days we got along and some days I hated him. But in his absence, I appreciate him more. Same with my mother. I didn't realize it when I saw them every day, but I have a lot of respect for my parents. I think the only reason I work so hard now is because of the way they raised me. Sean, that's so beautiful. Huh? Are you crying? <laughs> that story about your family was just very touching. Thank you, Divine One. Here, take this poultice. It's good for swelling around the eyes. Oh, <laughs> thanks, John. I needed that. I have something for you, Jean. Medicinal herbs? Oh, this is quite a lot. I found a place full of them in the forest, so I picked as many as I could. Wow, thank you so much. This is going to make a big difference back home. What you said about your parents really struck me. I want to help your family as much as I can. Thanks, Divine One. Hey, what happened to your arm? It's all scratched up. Oh. Uh, right after I found the patch of herbs, I slipped and tumbled down a hill. Oh no! Here, sit down, and I'll treat it right now. It, it doesn't really bother me. Please, Divine One. I'd hate for your wounds to stay open and get infected. All right, go ahead then. Let's see here. You know, Divine One, I think it was good that I left the island to travel with you. Yeah? You're a very generous person. But you don't know how to be generous to yourself. As long as I'm around, no matter how little care you have for your well-being, you'll be fine. I want to pay you back a hundred times over for all the kindness you've shown me. <laughs> wow. There. All treated. It should heal quickly now. Thanks. And I'm glad to have you along too. We pulled up a pretty big haul today. Mostly thanks to you. You're not tired from working so hard? Well, having you along made it fun. I feel like I could keep going for hours. Uh-oh. Looks like you're hurt again. Huh? Oh, no. That's from the last battle. I stepped in to protect an ally. I had it healed right afterward, but I guess it still left a mark. You should try this. It's an ointment I made from the herbs we picked last time. If you smear it on, it should keep the redness down. You'll have to wait a bit for it to dry. Thank you. If you're ever hurt, or even just in trouble, I hope you know you can count on me. I want you to be able to count on me the way so many others are counting on you. But, Jean, don't you know? 
I already do. You... you do? Of everyone in the army, you're somebody I know I can always rely on. In fact, I've been thinking you deserve to have this pact ring I've been carrying. I don't know. Something that precious should go to someone worthier. I can't think of anyone worthier than you. You've always been there for me, after all. Well, I guess that makes sense. Thank you. From now on, you can consider me your personal physician. <laughs> I wouldn't have it any other way. But if that's how it's going to be, I've got a lot of reading and practice to get to. The Divine One's personal physician had better not make any mistakes. Take your time. Once this war is over, I should have a lot fewer injuries to patch up. True. Um... Thanks for believing in me. I'll work hard to become a doctor worthy of treating you. Fire Emblem, engage. <laughs> 